Good morning to all and welcome to the introductory session uh, of the open course offered by the Department of Botany on Agri-Based Micro Enterprises. The course objectives of this particular open course is to provide basic knowledge on organic farming. Uh, it also uh, gives you the basic information on business opportunities in organic farming and related agriculture practices. Uh, it also describes the sustainable agriculture and organic farming. Uh, it creates an awareness and enthusiasm on ornamental gardening, nursery management, floriculture and mushroom cultivation and tissue culture techniques. The syllabus prescribed for this open course is as follows the organic farming and compo uh, composting techniques horticulture and nursery management floriculture and flower arrangement mushroom cultivation and spawn production tissue culture and my micro propagation it also give you ample opportunities to uh, get some uh, hands-on training on different agriculture practices and uh, gardening tools the first topic in the syllabus is organic farming and composting techniques. It includes organic manures and fertilizers, preparation of different composts, biological control of diseases and pests, and it also deals with sustainable agriculture practices. Then the next part is horticulture and nursery management. The horticulture and nursery management includes preparation of potting mixture for uh, uh, different practices then common garden tools that are in use in uh, gardens uh, crop fields etc and then the methods of plant propagation uh, by natural uh, ways and gardening including types of gardens in including uh, rockery uh, uh, lawns etc then nursery management practices that are available uh, in in the country and in the state then packaging of fruits vegetables nursery products and flowers uh, this is uh, mainly meant for marketing and transportation then the next interesting part is floriculture and flower arrangement which is an emerging field uh, nowadays uh, it will give you an understanding about the prospects of the, this particular topic problems uh, involved in this particular title then scope common cut flowers common leaves in flower arrangement flower arrangement types dry flower arrangements we will be dealing in detail all these aspects uh, in the classes another interesting field is the mushroom cultivation and spawn production spawn is nothing but the seeds that are used for the cultivation of mushrooms so it includes different types of mushrooms including button mushrooms, oyster mushroom, milky mushroom, and poisonous mushrooms. Unless you get to know what are all the poisonous mushrooms available in and around you, it will be very difficult to go ahead with uh, farming practices or cultivation of mushrooms. And then we'll be uh, dealing with the isolation and the preparation practices of spawns that are the seeds of mushrooms then oyster and milky mushroom cultivation practices will be uh, dealt in detail uh, these are the two mushrooms that will be used as type specimens to understand the different types of mushroom cultivation practices and farm designs and pests and disease control is another uh, uh, portion and value added products that can be made out of mushroom including pickles candies dried mushrooms then the last part uh, is the plant tissue culture and micro propagation uh, nowadays, even uh, farmers are using or, or uh, making uh, plantlets by using uh, tissue culture method. So it will be very interesting. It includes some technical terminologies like a totipotency, sterilization, transplanting, hardening, etc. Then uh, another interesting part of the syllabus is hands-on training, wherein you get some uh, basic training on different practices and garden uh, uh, tools uh, directly from trainers. It includes preparation of potting mixture using organic manures like uh, cow dung, coconut cake, vermicompost, neem cake, etc. Then uh, it, uh, another interesting part is to give training on the preparation of vermicompost in, in the campus or in your house. 
then uh, familiarization of common garden tools is another uh, hands on training part the estimation of germination percentage which is very much uh, essential for understanding uh, the seed germination uh, um, science behind the seed germination and also it will be helpful in nursery management practices then uh, uh, it includes certain demonstrations also including effect of rooting hormone on stem cutting tea budding epicotyl grafting and air layering again uh, garden components from photographs which are not in use in our campus uh, then different mushrooms and preparation of polybag of pleurotus pleurotus is a type of mushroom uh, and if time permits we will be visiting a tissue culture lab or a nursery or or a mushroom cultivation unit so another component which is included uh, uh, in the syllabus is to find out self employment opportunities it includes uh understanding different funding agencies available in the country or in the state and also different uh, employment schemes that are available uh, um in the state state and central governments it includes um, uh, startup programs also and also uh, we would be giving you training uh, to how to approach a funding agency to get financial support including proposal or application then uh, we will be introducing special schemes for uh, women empowerment programs thank you thank you very much for listening